welcome to another Bleistift video and today I want to look at the Zebra TSV. It's a very small mechanical pencil. Here's a normal sized mechanical pencil in comparison. And yeah, let's write down some information. So it's the Zebra TSV and I think there's only an 0.5 millimeter version available. I bought mine uh, in 2009 and back then I paid £2.50. And I had a look on the, C on, on the archived Zebra webpage and I saw that at that time and a bit earlier a Zebra, at least Zebra in the UK, they seem to be targeting uh, companies to sell their pens as as advertising pens. So I'm not sure whether it's still the case, but at that time uh, you, you could order this pen from, from Zebra UK directly. They would print your logo on and if you bought a thousand of them, it, it, it was the, the, the cheapest price you could get. I think it started with you buying 50 of them. If you bought a thousand of them, uh, one of them would cost you £1.72. Uh, with with your logo printed on them and with any extra color you want printed on would be 10p more So I paid two pounds fifty these days mm. uh, It seems to be you know of, of course slightly more expensive inflation and everything, but uh, it's still uh, quite similar so in the UK Yeah uh, You you still pay under five quid in the USA you pay a bit more than five dollars yeah, in the UK. You pay under five quid in Europe. You pay under five euros. Uh, fixing this to a very specific um, ex uh, price is probably not worth it because uh, you know th th there are quite a bit of fluctuations there. And with this not being a, a, a fifty quid pen but a five quid pen, any small fluctuation in price. It's a huge percentage of the overall price. So I think there's only 0.5 and it has a metal body. So it's the only version I know of. And like I said, it's a very small pen. This can be quite useful. I mean, here's an example where this could be useful. Uh, this is a case I got from Sean. And look what I do. I usually carry a pencil in there and then so that the, the the point of the pencil doesn't uh, damage the leather I put this paper in but as you can see you know the the point of the pencil keeps breaking off so yeah, for those kind of situations where you want a small pen to carry with you uh, this might be a good solution it's obviously not going to be extremely comfortable um, to write with this pen, just because the diameter is so so slim, so narrow, uh, so small. But uh, as a kind of emergency pen, it's nice and it's fairly sturdy, at least on the outside, because of the metal body. Inside, well, that's a different matter if you look at the clutch. You can see it's it's a plastic clutch, but you know it's, it's a, not an expensive pen, or not not too expensive. And I, mean, I had mine for nearly ten years, and it's still it's still fine. So uh, clutch mechanism, plastic. Okay, let's go to the diameter of the body. So let's have a look. Yeah, just over five millimeters. Grip section is not any wider. Made, I assume in Japan, it says Zebra Japan. So let's just assume it's Japan. Weight. Um, let's check the weight. Let's 
6.5 gram, obviously fairly light. Length, okay. Yeah, 10 centimeters. Okay, what else can we say? There's a little sleeve here. It's a, a static sleeve. It's not sliding or anything. It's not retractable. Uh, so let's write a fixed sleeve. Fixed short sleeve. It has an emergency eraser. Uh, no cleaning needle. And obviously, with this being a very small pencil, this is a very small eraser size. So, yeah. Let's have a look where the center of gravity is. Yeah, center of gravity is about... Yeah. A bit further down the line. Okay, specialty, very small. Okay, what's missing? Lead capacity. Let's get some 0.5 millimeter LEDs. Okay, here are a few. So there's one in the pencil. Let's see. How many we can take with us? Uh, should we try five first? One, two, three, four, five. Let's try that. Yeah. We can get even more in. Let's try another five. Ten. Well, ten is a bit too much. Minus twos, eight, one too much. Come. Okay, so let's say one plus seven. Yeah, one in the sleeve. Seven in the body. Um, let's check one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's see how much we forward the lead when we click. Uh, six point eight. Millimeter, so one click. We'll advance the lead by uh, 0 0.68 millimeter. Okay, yeah, some uh, close up. So, this is how the front looks like. And here's the back. So very useful if you want a pencil to transport around, like an emergency pencil. Yeah. Okay. Thank you for watching, and goodbye.